Hello everyone and how is everyone doing? So today I'm going to show you on how to get over 300,000 experience per hour with range. All you have to do is travel north of the lodestone in Edgeville, keep heading north into the wilderness and the nearest rift you jump inside and you will be inside the chaos tunnels. I strongly suggest for this method you have at least 70 dungeoneering but if you don't that's fine you don't have to have it but it would help. Once you are inside take the northwestern portal this will take you to the zombies area and then you head northwest once again and then jump inside that portal it'll take you slightly under 40 seconds to get to the black demons which is what we're going to be killing today they are really easy and since the revolution came out it's a lot easier than it was before and there's not as much spamming involved but it's still really good experience then head north east and then north west again past the dust devils and then you'll be inside the black demons area there are four demons here so if you have got 70 dungeoneering you can either jump inside the portal or you can stay outside depending on what you want to do but if you do go inside this area as you can see there's a lot more demons inside but you only need around four to actually do this method effectively so as long as there's four demons that'll be fine to get the most experience per hour, I suggest not picking up any items. The most expensive items you can pick up is the rune items, so that's like rune chain body, rune square shield, those kind of items are the most expensive. So if you do feel like picking them up, you can do so, but if you want the most experience per hour, you should forget about picking up items. Bring a charming imp, because they do drop a lot of coonstorm charms. It really does depend if you actually want the charms or not, but there's no reason not to pick them up. So if you do bring a charming imp, that would be great. And as you can see in my inventory, I'm using infernal urns. What they basically do is that every single infernal ash that is dropped by any of these monsters will go straight inside this infernal urn. And once it's filled up, it'll teleport them away for some prayer experience. Um, you should do this. There's no reason why you shouldn't be doing it unless you're not aiming for any prayer experience but it's really cheap, there's no reason not to do it and this will greatly boost your experience per hour. I worked out that after one hour you should be getting around 310,000 experience here and please remember that's 310,000 using my gear. I'm not using the best gear possible, I didn't use any prayer bonus, I use overload and that is it, nothing else. If I would have used maybe um, ascension crossbows, maybe use my prayer. I probably would have been able to obtain around 360 to around 370 experience per hour, but Chaotix is pretty fine here. There's no reason not to use Chaotix. They are weak to bolts, so you might want to use range. I haven't tried melee or magic here, so you might want to try that also. If you are going to be bringing infernal urns, you will notice that your prayer experience per hour will be 20,000. I haven't included that in the total experience, but um, that is 20,000 experience per hour in prayer. So it's not bad, but it's not the best of course, but it still helps, so there's no reason not to do it. I hope this method has helped you. If you have any questions at all or need any help with anything, just post below and I will read them. I'll always read all my comments and I hope you enjoyed this video. So thanks for watching and I'll see you all soon.